In the previous video, I showed how to create a new database with a new table called T-Students. This is for a college administration system. Now I'm going to create another new table. This one is for courses that might run in this new college. Again, an administrator might want to use this to create new courses. So I'm going to call my table T-Courses. And I'm going to start adding in different fields. So in this table, I only want two fields. I want to keep it nice and short. I'm just going to put in a course ID. And this is a primary key. And we saw that we leave that as type int. Uh, length, uh, leave it at 8. And because it's a primary key, I saw the last time that I clicked on primary. And I added an index. And I checked on auto increment. And then the other side of this is just a course name. So course underscore name, and this is going to be a varicar, and it's going to have a length of 80 characters. That's all I need to do to create my t-courses table for the moment. So I click on save, and I can see my new t-courses table coming up in my college. I can fill this with data through the insert tab, or if I've got a PHP system running on top of it, it can insert data through insert queries. And that's my new T courses table.